Were you guys in the car though? No. No. Just them two. Us two. Alright. You too? Yeah. She's the drug man. Do you have your purse? No, I don't have anything on me right now. Do you have a license on you or anything? No, not on me. I have a picture of it. Are you guys hurt at all? Ma'am? Are you hurt at all? No. I'm okay. I'm hitting it for a little bit, but I'm okay. Alright. Insurance. Thank you. Got that? Registration. Oh, okay. Go, 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 go. Registration. I'm okay for a number. Registration. I've never really been pulled over, so I don't know. Which one? Is this the registration? I've never been pulled over, so I don't know. Um, yep, that's it. Okay. Alright, and your license? Um, he took it. So, uh, so you were driving? It's okay, take your time. <laughs> it's not okay. Alright, where are you coming from? It's coming from my friend's house. Uh, walk with me over here, okay? No. <laughs> I've never even really been through that It's okay, it's no. alright, take your time. So what happened? We were driving and we got a phone call from her boyfriend and I looked down at the phone and I... <laughs> and I crashed into the pole. Okay. I didn't even, I looked down and I looked back up. Can I help you, ma'am? Do you need help? No. Oh okay. Are you walking? No, I, I just came out to see what happened. Okay. Alright, so you were at your friend's house? Yes, and we left and I went to drop her off. And I looked down at the phone because our boyfriend called her. And I looked down for too long, I guess. Okay. And I, how old are you? 18. Alright, do you have anything to drink or anything like that tonight? No, I haven't had anything to drink. Okay. When's the last time you had something to drink? Um, probably like a week ago. Okay, nothing I don't to drink, drink and drive. I don't. I'm just asking if you had anything no, to drink. No, my parents are alcoholics and I don't do that. Okay. But you didn't have anything to drink? No. Alright, what were you doing at your friend's house? I'm just hanging out. Just hanging out? Alright. And you're not hurt? No. You're my lips are a little busted, but it's not, nothing bad. Can I see your lip? Okay, so you got a little blood. Nothing bad. Did you hit the airbag or yeah. the steering wheel? Did you hit the steering wheel? No, the airbag. The airbag. Mm -hmm. All right. And it was just you and your other friend were in the car? Yes. All right. So where were you coming from? Like, what's the street? This way. You were coming from this way? Yes. You looked down at the phone? Mm -hmm. All right. What made you look at the phone other than the boyfriend calling? Nothing. Just him. He was on the phone. He was talking. And I looked down, and I looked back up, and we were going, and we just crashed. Okay. Do you have any... um? I know you say you're not injured from the motor vehicle crash, but do you have any medical conditions? No. Anything that would affect your no. eyes, anything like that? No. All right. I know you said you weren't drinking, okay? Yeah, you can test me. That's I'm fine. just going to check your eyes. That's fine. If, you, if you, the eyes are fine, That's fine and I don't see any indications, you're not going to do any other tests, okay? Yep. And you said you have nothing to drink, right? No. Okay. And you're okay, right? You said? Do you have a favor to stand back here for me? Mm -hmm. put your feet together. Alright. Can I keep? I'm really cold. It's okay. Okay. Alright. Hold this. Yep. Alright, do me a favor. Just look at the tip of my pen for me. Okay? You see the tip of my pen? Yeah. Alright, I want you to touch it with the tip of my pen, okay? Mm -hmm. Can you touch it with your right pen, index finger? Good. Alright, what I want you to do, I want you to, I'm going to move the pen from side to side, okay? Yeah. What I want you to do is I want you to follow with your eyes and eyes only. Do you understand? Yeah. Do you understand that? Yeah. Trust your eyes. Keep looking at the pen, okay? Yeah. Okay. I do have to slip back here further, okay? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. One more complaint, right? What's your first name? Megan. All right. And you have anything to drink? No. All right. Do me a favor, stand just like that. Yeah. Put your feet together for me, okay? Put your hands down by your side, okay? Yeah. What I want you to do, I want you to put your right foot in front of your left foot, touching hand to toe. Right like this. Foot yep. Yeah. All right. Keep your hands down on your side, okay? Yeah. All right. Just like that. Now stay in that position. That's called the starting position. I want you to stay in that position as I explain and demonstrate the test for you. Do you understand? Yep. Yeah. Okay. What I want you to do is I want you to take a series of small steps, okay? Each step you're gonna count out loud, one, two, three, and so forth. Okay, if you lose your balance, you can just put your foot back. You can just put your foot back if you lose your balance, okay? All right, and you're gonna count with each step, one, two, three, and so forth, okay? With each step, you're gonna to touch your heel to your toe, okay? It's like this, one, two, three, and so forth, you get to nine, okay? Once you get to nine, you're gonna take a series of small steps, you're gonna turn around, you're gonna come back. Do you understand? Yes. Do you understand the test? Yes. All right, do me a favor, put your right foot in front of your left foot, touching heel to toe. <clears throat> All right, you can begin the test when you're ready, okay? Make sure you count out loud. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. All right, for the next test, what you do, I'll just put your, your heels together like this, kind of make like a little angle. Yeah. Okay. Step back a little bit. I don't want you on that end up there. There you go, go. All right, what you do, you're gonna pick whatever, pick, you're going to pick whatever foot you feel more comfortable with, whether it be your right leg or your left leg, okay? You're going to raise approximately six inches off the ground, keeping both legs straight. Well, can I put my pants on? Yeah. I yeah. have pants in my car. Yep. I'm yeah. freezing. You can't get my pants on my car. She's got pants. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, move real quick. Move for off the conversation. Okay. All right, we can just do it right no, here, okay? Fine. That's okay. All right, so like I said, you're going to put your heels yeah. together like this. Okay. Whatever foot, like, uh, whatever leg you feel right. more comfortable, you're going to raise yeah. approximately six inches off the ground. You're going to be keeping both legs straight, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. Imagine a soda can out but, uh, underneath your foot. You're going to count in this manner. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, yeah. three, one thousand, four, one thousand, yeah. thousand, and so forth until I tie you stop. You understand? Yeah. All right, so I'm going to demonstrate it for you, okay? I'm going to raise my right leg. It's going to go one, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, yes. four, one thousand, five, one thousand. Look down at your foot and yeah. count, okay? Do you 1, understand? 000. Yes. Keep both legs straight, okay? Yeah. Okay. 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, 4, 1,000, 5, 1,000, 6, 1,000, 7, 1,000. You okay? Yes. All right. 8, 1,000, 9, 1,000, 10, 1,000, 11, 1,000. All right, come back here. Come back here. All right. I'm not going to embarrass you in front of your friends right now. But you're going to have to get my car, okay? I'm sorry. All right. Yeah, at this point, you're going to arrest for DUI. It's mine. Okay, just have a seat inside the car. <laughs> I, don't, I don't want to do. <laughs> just try to relax. No, I can't. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to lose my job. I work. You got her information? Hers? Yeah, I got no, no, you got, got hers. Her yeah. yeah. How old are you? I'm 18. Did you have anything to drink tonight? A while earlier. I'm okay right now, though. I'm sober right now. Okay. So, with you being like 18, you can't drive a car and yeah. then you see an alcohol at all. Mm -hmm. um, I know. 
We need to find her ride home though. Her? Yeah. We could bring her if you need, or well, she's I can get a hold of her parents. She's got to come back to our station. Okay. Can Can I go there and then you got, get you, her a ride? Yeah, you can come to the station. The Magnolia with us. Police Station, right yeah. there. Okay. Do you guys all have a car together? Well, that's yeah. My boyfriend he was driving behind us. Who, and we who has a car? Who said yeah? All right. What's your name, man? Jose. What uh? You guys want to go to the station and pick her up in a little bit? Like. 30 minutes, an hour. Could be like an hour. It could. Yeah. Is that okay? Yeah. And she, she doesn't really bother me. Right? She's got to be released to somebody. Um, I, know. I don't okay. know if she wants to be released to her parents or not. Probably not. Yeah. That's, I, I, I know her parents. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Um, why don't you do this? Did you want to come with us? Can I go with her? You can come to our station, um, but this officer's got to stay by for the tow. Okay. okay. Um, she has to wait for him to get done. And then he can bring you to her station and we can call whoever to come pick you guys up. You guys weren't drinking, right? No. Oh. They were just meeting us at McDonald's. All right. Just give me a You got it good? Yes. Right. Matt, you have the original? Yeah. Matt? The registration. Yeah. Yeah, I got, got it. Can we meet you guys there? Yeah, you, you can meet us there. That's fine. Yeah. Alright, I'm backing up, guys. <laughs> Twenty three oh eight central. I'll be transporting one adult female from my location to my ten one. Star mileage seven one two two five. Uniform, Saratoga, It's on trial mail, ending last three, two, two, six.
Okay, <laughs> just stay off your phone, okay? I gotta take it. Come on. Come on. Give her a call, okay? Megan? Yes. Okay. And I need you yes. Alright, Megan. Um, I'm going to read the form to you. Alright, I'm going to give you one to follow along with me. Okay. Um, if you have any questions you don't understand, something stop me. No, okay. Okay. Well, if you don't understand. No, I'll understand. Okay. <laughs> the one thing I need you to do, okay, I need you to spit out the gum, alright? Yeah. That's fine. So I know you mentioned you're going to lose everything and all that kind of stuff. We don't notify your job. Nothing like that. Um, so, you said you were... I mean, I don't want to speak for your job, but I think you're going to be okay. I think you made a mistake. I think you know that. Okay. Um, let me I've never done you know. something like this. All right, I'm going to read this to you, okay? Yes. Do you want to follow along with that piece of paper there? Yes. <clears throat> All right, Megan. You've been arrested for driving while intoxicated, NJSA 394-50. Number two, the law requires a submit samples of your breath for the purpose of testing to determine the alcohol content. Number three, a record of the taking of breath samples, including the test results, will be made. Upon your request, a copy of that record will be made available to you. I'll tell you what the reading is after, okay? Yeah. After you have provided samples of your breath for testing, you have a, the right <clears throat> at your own expense to have a person or position of your own selection take independent samples of your breath, blood, or urine for independent testing. Number five, if you refuse to provide samples of your breath, you will be issued a separate summons for the refusal. A court might find you guilty of both refusal and driving while intoxicated. Number six, if a court finds you guilty of the refusal, you'll be subject to various penalties, including license revocation up to 20 years, a fine up to $2,000, installation of an uh, ignition airlock, and referral to an intoxicated driver's resource center. These penalties, in addition to penalties imposed by the court for any other offense you are found guilty. Number seven, you have no legal right to have an attending physician or anyone else present for the purpose of taking breath samples. You have no legal right to refuse, give, or delay giving samples of your breath. Number eight, any response to you that is ambiguous or conditional in any respect to my request they provide breath samples will be treated as a refusal to submit breath testing. Even if you agree to take the test but then do not follow my instructions and not properly perform the test or not provide significant breath samples, I will charge you the refusal for breath testing. Number nine, this is important, okay? I repeat that the law requires you submit samples of your breath for testing. Will you submit samples of your breath? What is it? Explain to everything that's going on now, okay? 
So now we're just going to kind of sit here. We'll talk for 20 minutes. Okay. And then I'll start the machine. Okay. Um, do you have any watches on you? No. Okay. Can you give me a fair and just lift it up for me? Okay. Do you have anything in your mouth other than that bubble gum? No. Can you do me a favor? Can you open your mouth for me? And let your head back? Okay. All right. Um, we'll sit here. We'll talk for 20 minutes. <clears throat> I do have a big one, but it's dead. You can take it. <laughs> um, we'll sit here and talk for 20 minutes. We'll do the test. Um, at that point, I'll provide you with a reading, okay? Um, which, like I told you, I'll tell you. I'll tell you whatever it is. Um, oh my God, I'm gonna go to jail. Listen, Matt, Matt, you're not gonna. I know. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because we were drinking earlier, and I know I shouldn't have drunk. Megan. No. Let me explain this to you. So you don't go to jail. It's a ticket. I don't care what it is. <clears throat> on my record and that's not me. I would have never drove them home. <laughs> they, they, they were 10 times worse than me. I could, couldn't let them drive. <laughs> I wouldn't let them. <laughs> and I should have just said, no, no. <laughs> this is not me. <laughs> I would never. <sighs> I have to get fingerprinted for my work in less than two weeks, and they're going to see that. We don't fingerprint you. No, no. Is it going to be on my record? Because they're going to see that. And so it's not... Hold on, hold on. I'm going to answer your questions for you. I know it's upsetting. So it's not a criminal record. It goes on your what's called an abstract. It's like a driving record. My car is gone. Well, your car is not gone. It's gone. I have no way to get to work. I have no way to... Get to work. Um, we have insurance on the car, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> it don't mean anything. I don't think I have full coverage. So my car is gone. I have to pay thousands of dollars. <laughs> As soon as we're done, she needs to know what happened. As soon as we do this, we'll let her know, okay?
It'll be up on Jogging Record, right? Yeah, it's called an abstract, yeah. I mean, you gotta understand. Because I have it. Well, it still has to go to court and all, you know that, That's right? fine, I know. So, you could be found not guilty, you could be... No, and I know I'll plead guilty because I know I did have a couple drinks. So, I don't care. I already know when you do this breathalyzer, I'm probably not going to pass. All right, hold on. No. Just I... let me tell you, I'm wearing a camera, okay? That's fine, and I don't care. Because I already know once it comes back. I already know. <laughs> I know I shouldn't have drove, but I wouldn't let my friends drive home. <laughs> because I'm too generous and I know I shouldn't have been. I just need to call my mom. You will as soon as you do the test, okay? Can we do it? Like hey, you got so the thing is you have to wait twenty minutes. And that's the benefit of you, okay? You said you're 18. Yes. Are you in high school or did you graduate? I already graduated. I would never. I just did it with the driving. I know I've been the wrong because I should have just said. Thirty seconds. All right, for purpose of the accident, who was in the car with you? Me and my friend, Michaela. Just those two? Yes. Okay. Or just you and Michaela? Me and Michaela, yeah. All right. How old's Michaela? 18. All right. I think she might be coming back here. Oh, I didn't mean to get anyone in trouble. Oh, no, no, she's not in trouble. She's not in trouble. I hope not. Pennsylvania, Mike, Bravo, Sierra. Did Michaela come back? Did Michaela come back? No, they're on their way back. Okay. Bye, everyone's here.
Yeah, yeah, your friends are your friends are picking you up. Well, I'm gonna be able to leave after night? Yeah, you're not going to jail. Okay. You literally so let me explain something to you now, you're kinda of more calm. I don't wanna make it seem like it's not you know No, it is a big deal. Yeah. I know. Um But you get you get a ticket. You're gonna get a couple tickets. That's and those funny. tickets are gonna have a court deal on. Then you're gonna go to court and everything gets figured out in court. Regardless of what you blow. The legal limit in New Jersey is point oh eight for someone up twenty one and above. Someone below twenty one, it's zeros. I know. And I'm obviously gonna Hold up. Now remember I'm telling you I'm wearing a body one camera is recording. Okay. Okay. But I don't wanna lie. I know you and you're very so let me another thing I'll tell you is there's there, there's always some reports on. On the report, we have to kind of talk about, you know, the person's cooperation. You're very cooperative. I know. Um, I always will be. And like I said, I think you made a mistake, but you're already starting to take the actions of that and own it. Um, it's not going to destroy your life, okay? You just got to. But it will because I'll always have a guilty conscience of it. I could have probably killed someone. I should have never done that. I should have never. Well, luckily, as of now, you only had a telephone pole. Oh, my car is gone. Well, oh, my God. My car could be, be replaced, you know. Just don't let it snowball. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I don't want to say too much, but I live a really rough life at home. <laughs> I know it's not an excuse and it never will be. But when I have a chance, I go hang out with my friends. And I have fun. And I just didn't want them to drive home like that because I knew they were worse than me. And I thought I would be fine. But clearly that one phone call, I got distracted. And I know I'm on camera and I know this is all going to be taken to court. But I just want to be honest. I don't like lying. And I never will lie. <laughs> I've barely ever been pulled over. Like I don't do that stuff. Been 20 minutes yet. It's six more minutes. Oh my god. <laughs> once the the longest part is the 20 minutes. Yes, I just want to get it over with. Um, once we get that machine up and running, you're talking a couple minutes after that. Um, I don't even know. I don't even want to know what I'm <sighs> Oh, it's up to you. I can tell you. No, I'm going to want to know, but I don't okay. want to know. Yeah, Matt, can you grab our tissue, please?
Crazy. All right, just to clarify, no electronics on your right, no cell phones, no smartwatches, yep. earbuds, nothing like that. Okay. Nick, give them 12, 6, 6 o'clock, and the phone number to fax over. Okay. Yeah, I'll call them. 32, Matt. Is that on? Okay. 32. 32. Yeah. I'm going to skip you all my stuff and then I'll start punching it in. I'll get the time for, uh, on the bench for my BWC. Yeah. Okay. Two minutes. No, we're not going to throw it out. No, no, I'll put it out. Okay, your phone. good. No, I'll put it out your phone. Thank you. Activate on the camera. Another 20 minutes, I'll switch groups completed. Yeah, it's an easy to sign this uh, form. I'll explain it all to you. Hmm? I'll explain it. So, you're here to sign her out? Yeah. Okay. So, basically, you're going to sign what's called the John's Law form of okay. potential liability. This thing that you're, you're signing is saying that she's not going to be driving mm -hmm. a vehicle for 12 hours. If so, you okay. could be held liable. Okay. All right. Just come in here. Let me just print out the form. Just wait right here. And I'll uh, let you read it and sign it.
things. Come on, load. I'm just I'm printing out two forms. One's gonna be your copy. The uh, next one's gonna be my copy. Okay. I'm pin right there. So you just wanna take your time, read it. I just gave you a brief what it stated, but. Is it the same? It was basically the same thing. Okay. It's just one's gonna be your copy, so you can hold on to it. Does it mean you're potentially subject to criminal penalties and say, civil liability? So you, uh, you guys leave, mm -hmm. and then she gets in a car and drives somewhere and gets in an accident or gets pulled over or whatever. You're the one okay. you could be held liable. This, uh, that's what that's meaning. Like you're okay. not anything that happened right now. What she's getting, you're not going to be held. It's going to be on her. But if she gets leaves within the twelve hours. Yeah. You could be held liable. Okay. Accept it and bottom one if you don't. Top one. Yeah. Okay. That, that's if you're accepting it. Okay. Yes, please. You can hold on to one copy. So uh, she has a few more. Uh, hit there, ask her a few more questions, and then she should be released. So if you okay. want to wait out in the hallway, or if you want to wait out, wait out in the car, it's whatever you would like. Okay, I can wait in the hallway. Okay. Thank you. Do you have any questions? Is she okay? Yeah, she's fine. She's just upset, but she like we trying to. She's not going sent to jail. Uh, she's over the age of eighteen, so we're not going to let her. We're not telling her parents. She she's not a minor. I'm sure. She that will get dealt with. Well, that will get dealt with, but that's on her, and like she mm. can tell them. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. No problem. One camera.
Um, so, uh, this is uh, going to be a 450, a GUI drum, for 12 hours. Well, I ain't going to go anywhere. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They didn't get this one unless they tow it out of the yard. Guys, watch out. I think my car's unlocked. Yeah, can you move my car up? Slow down, 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 wait. You gotta move the car up. Alright, you're good. South Brown and Ward. I've heard something about this. 21. 21. Yeah, they're going to be 271894. Uh, someone else transporting that person. Yeah. Some of that big stuff. Thank you so much. All right. Have a nice one. Thank you. Thank you, guys. And cool.